Meet Swagbot, Australia's newest and brightest cattle herder. The AI-powered robot was created by researchers at the University of Sydney, with the aim of making cattle farming more efficient and sustainable. The machine autonomously analyzes the plant health, type and density of fields, and directs cows to the most nutritious areas. Once the animals, once the cattle are used to the robot, um, they will follow the robot around. And so if you move to certain parts of the pasture, the animals will follow through. And, and if you stop, then they'll stop and they can graze that particular part. This avoids overgrazing and preserves the soil's nutrition, which in turn supports plant health and livestock capacity. The machine also helps farmers monitor the health of their cattle. It senses assessing the animal's movements to create a unique profile for each member of the herd. These key functions allow farmers to make better use of their resources, which is increasingly in short supply, to improve productivity and meet global demand. It allows us to assess our paddocks in real time in a much more detailed way than what you can now, particularly if they start bringing in real time measurement of things like nitrogen, potassium, phosphorus. And you know, the, the, the population of the world is growing. Um, and we have the same amount of land to feed that population and so maximising how much food we deliver for the same amount of imports, even less in terms of the imports, is what's important. And the only way we can do that is with precision agriculture. The precision of the technology also makes cattle farming more environmentally friendly. So using less chemicals, uh, using less water, and those things really, both of those things really uh, lent themselves towards robotics. Swagbot may prove to be a game changer for a major beef exporter like Australia, which faces a hot and dry climate. And it's just the beginning. Amid a growing trend of robotics being developed for the agriculture industry, scientists are confident there will soon be more robots like this one on farms in Australia and around the world. Dolphine Chen and Rosie Greninger for Taiwan Plus.